Welcome to Mahjong Central. My name is Michelle. I'm going to do some random pulls for Japanese style Mahjong, also known as Reach. This is an awesome style. I love it. It's very sophisticated, very complex, very strategic, and very flexible. If you don't know how to play yet, click show more below the video towards the bottom left to open up the video description and then there's a link to some tutorials there. I challenge you to learn it. It's really a lot of fun. In these random pulls, I'm going to try to do six in 15 minutes. This is a great way to learn all the different Yaku that you can play for. You gotta have one Yaku to win. I have all my tiles out and they've been mixed. I have a Hanchen indicator that I'm just going to alternate between north, between, I'm go, I have a Hanchen indicator that I'm going to alternate between east and south. And then I have some Tenbo here. I'm just going to use these to help me track how many I do. Then I have dice that I'm going to use to see which seat I'm in. And that way it randomizes for my decision making. So let's roll. I rolled a nine. That would be east. East is, pre is my seat wind and the east round is the wind of the round. So this is the first random pull. Oh, let's pull Dora. East, south, west, north. So north is Dora. As east, we get to have 14 tiles to start with. Let's see what we can do. There's a west and a north. Only two honors. Let's see if we have chi potential here. There's a five, six, one, nine, four. Ooh, there's a two. That's nice. There's a potential chi right there, or maybe a potential chi here. And then here we have a potential chi. This one's isolated. That's isolated. Okay, this is not bad. Okay, here we go. This is how I would play this. Pinfu and reach. This is Dora though. This is not my seat wind, nor is it the wind of the round. We can use that as the pair tile, maybe. So here's a potential chi. This is a potential chi with the two. We'd have to get rid of one or the other. Potential chi, potential chi. Here's a chi right here. Either way, there's room in here for expansion. And then that can be the pair. I'd get rid of these first. Three, four, five, six. Okay, that's what I would do. If you would do something different, let me know. Let's roll. I rolled a four, so that is north. We're in seat north, and it is south round. This is the second random pull. So we're non-dealer this time. We only get 13 tiles. Okay, here we go. Ooh. Oh, we're non-dealer. There's an east, a pair of east. It's south round. So we won't get score for that unless we go for a half flush. Let's see how this shakes out. 
we're in between bams and dots. I think I would play all pwn here because we do have two pair. Okay, pair, pair, pair. If we play all pwn, that would not be bad score. I think we have too many in each suit here to clear to a half flush. So I would try for all pwn. We need two more pair to make that work. It'd be nice if we could get a pair of red dragons. That would be sweet. Oh, I forgot to draw Dora. Three bam is Dora. Now Dora, that's a bummer. If you would do something different here, let me know. You know what? I was just thinking. Maybe we should do pure double chi. Well, we would need another nine. No, that's a stretch. I think I would still try for all pwn. Okay. East round, third one. We are in seat 10. Seat 10 is south. Let's draw Dora before I forget. Eight bam is a Dora. We're non-dealer. Okay, here we go. Let's see. No honors. No, we have one. One honor. Okay, seven, nine, two. There's a potential chi. Six, eight, nine. There's a potential chi. This is isolated, isolated. Isol well, we can go either way, but either way, we need a seven crack here. Isolated, potential chi. Oh, wait, this is, if this were in order, I would have seen that wasn't isolated there. Okay, so here we go. We are in south seat, and it is east round. If we play pinfu, we have potential chi, potential chi, pair, potential chi. We would need to draw something here and here and here to create more chi's. This could be the pair. I'd throw that first. Ooh, we have Dora. Right here, Dora. That's nice. So I would play Pinfu. If we get a seven bam or nine bam, we could play pure double chi or mixed triple chi right here. Seven, nine, eight, nine, eight. If we get the nine bam or the seven bam, we could play mixed triple chi. Okay, let's play again. South round. We are in seat five, which is east. So we get 14, <clears throat> 14 tiles this time. Four, four, six. We're good. No honors. Do you think we can make Pinfu happen here? I'm thinking yes. Wow, this is going to be. This would be a quick win, I think. All right, so we have, do we have any pairs right here? We have two pair actually. Three, four, five, pure double chi right there. Three, four, five, three, five. We need a four dot for a pure double chi. 
we have Akadora, potential chi, potential chi, potential chi. So we would need to, let's see, one, two, three. Let's see here. This could be the pair. One, two, three, four, and a pair. So I guess Pinfu would be the way to go. We're set. We are set for Pinfu. Let's draw Dora. Two crack is Dora. No two crack. Okay, Chi pair. Potential, potential, potential. This is the two sided weight right here. For Pinfu, you have to have a Chi with a two sided weight. We need either a six bam or a nine bam. So we need to take care of these first. I would hold this as long as possible in case the pure double chi comes in because that would be another yaku. I'd throw these first. And we have Akadora with bling. Okay. If you would do something different, let me know. Back to east round. This is the fifth one. I rolled a seven. Seven is west. East, south, west, north. So east is Dora. If you can remember the progression of the winds by saying eat soup with nuts. Eat soup with nuts back to eat. East. East is Dora. We're non-dealer, so we get 13. East is Dora, and we're on east round. We're in seat west. We have a green and a white. Let's see here. I think I would play Pinfu. We have two discards, Potential Chi, Potential Chi, Isolated, Potential Chi, Potential Chi. All we need is a pair. One, two, three, four Chi's and a pair in here somewhere with these isolated tiles. These are all ready to go. So I would throw these away first. And of course, we would reach Pinfu's concealed. Oh wait, are any, yeah, here's a two-sided weight. Here's a two-sided weight. This is a two-sided weight. So yeah, we're set. You always have to make sure that you have two-sided weights on Pinfu because you don't want to get stuck unawares. We're on the last one, south round. And we are in seat six, which is south. East, south, eat soup. Soup is Dora, south. South is Dora. We are non-dealer. Okay, here we go. We have three winds here. North, west, south. Oh, we have lots of cracks. I think I would try for, oops. I think I would try for Hanitsu, half flesh. Potential chi, isolated. Potential chi, isolated or here, I mean, either way, I don't know. We would have drawing to do. These are all isolated though, every one of them. These are no good. I would try for half flesh. This is Dora.
Let me know what you think about random pulls for Japanese style. If you have a set at home, give it a try yourself and let me know your results. And let me know the next time you play if you feel like these helped you. I think it's a great way to learn on the Yaku. If you need to learn the Yaku, there's a link in the video description below to a player reference I created. You could always look online. There's all kinds of player references out there that can help. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, click subscribe. After you click subscribe, you're going to see a bell. If you click that bell, you'll get notification of when I post new videos. And that way you won't miss out on any of these exercises that maybe can give you a little bit of insight into the game and maybe you can pick up on a bit of strategy that can help give you an advantage at the table. I'm still learning myself, so I'm hoping to learn from the community. We can learn from each other. Between now and the next set of random pulls for Japanese style mahjong, also known as Reach, may all your picks be keepers.